everyone and a special hello to you for watching this video so if you're wondering why all these dolls lying here in towels um it's i thought it's time for a little bit of tlc on these dolls um okay most of them i i don't use the dolls but it's mo mostly it goes about the hair for me um okay so the dolls i usually use and this is sally um i did wash her hair before and um, i cut it a bit but i i'm gonna do it again because i've seen so 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 many times about this thing of the um hot boiling water you throw over the hair to make it straight because i want the hair to be straight so i'm gonna try that with them so i'm gonna wash her again and do that um mary's hair i didn't do anything since the day i bought this it's still in the little um uh, elastic band that was in the hair and the, as you can feel this product in the hair and um yeah i didn't touch out that i want to wash her hair definitely and the same with um steffi i didn't do anything to her hair yet it's just also the same as since the day i bought her so i wanted to definitely something to them and then this um doll is my oldest Barbie doll, genuine Barbie doll. It was my doll, um, which I then gave to my daughter, and now it's back by me. So um, this hair is, I don't know since that time what kind of hair they had in those years. So she most definitely came from the 80s, this doll, and um, uh, unfortunately her, her neck broke off, and um, I don't know how to fix it because I don't want to just glue it stuff although I don't really use this doll and it's still a very old way of articulation that she have only in the legs and um, yeah so I really want to do something because I know I did wash a many times before and then it, it came out every time beautiful after you washed it so I'm gonna do that and then this is um, also a genuine Barbie doll it was the first doll I bought when I started with the um, with my dollhouse, and um, I just love her hair, but it's full of product, so um, that's why I wanna just wash her hair as well to see how it will be afterwards. But I just love love her hair, and then this one, I bought a lot of dolls from um, Facebook Market, and she was one of them. It's also a Ginny and Bobby, and it's just also because of this beautifully i want to but you can feel this here is very dirty as uh, she, well, she is also very dirty and um so i want to see how hair is going to look like after it's been washed and then this one here is a steffi doll um i also don't really use her and um i also didn't did nothing to her since that i bought her but um i'm going to leave her hair just like this i'm not going to wash it because it's beautiful i can feel it's really soft i'm just going to uh, I'm going to take off this little paper tag well, for holding the hair together or something. I'm going to take that off. But um, I'm just then going to comb it a little bit because I think her hair is still it's beautiful. And um, because I didn't use this doll really um, ever. So that's why she's still so beautiful. So that's the only one I'm not going to wash the hair. The rest of them I'm going to wash the hair. And then we put conditioner in and then that boiling hot water over them and then i'm going to leave it overnight to dry so i'm just going to use my normal um shampoo and conditioner i'm going to use that and yeah so yeah let's get started
Okay, so are they all finished now off with the head comb. I think she looks beautiful, so I'm gonna leave her just like this. Nothing else has changed there. And then yeah, you can see the difference between real Barbies and just normal fake fashion dolls. Because look at that this hair that came out of the heads. So I hope the boiling water won't damage the hair. I will see about that. So yeah, so it's off to wash the hair. So let's go. Okay, I totally forgot about um, Kaylee. So I also want to do her hair as well. Um, if you can remember in the past, um, I colored her hair with a Sharpie. So I hope the color will stay in because she had most blonde hair and I colored it with a brown Sharpie. So yeah, I really hope that. So now I will see if the Sharpie is worth it. Um, and I hope her hair will stay brown. So yeah, um, I'm going to do Kaylee as well. And then I've decided with this one, I said most I didn't want to wash her hair, but I'm not going to wash it. I'm just going to, um, this piece here, try to do that with the boiling water thing, because I just want to have it more straight. So yeah, let's carry on with that. Okay, so let's do the boiling water thing and please just be cautious, it's very hot. Um, children do not do it without adult supervision, please. Um, so I'm just going to throw it over the heads. Let's see. Okay, all the dolls is done now. Um, I, I'm actually surprised I didn't know Mary's hair was so long. So um, there's just here and there a few things I want to trim while it's still wet. I'm going to leave her hair just like this because obviously it looks in a point. It's just a little teeny weeny. Um, little Kylie's here, I think, got damaged. That one time I was um, 
use clothing dyes for her hair and um, I boiled the hair moss for her maybe a half an hour or hour I can't remember so I think her hair just for on the ends it's very damaged if I um, can show you there on the ends it's very damaged her hair so um, I don't know if I must cut all that off and make her shorter or what will actually be the best to do Okay, so now everyone's hair is now cut. I did it from mess up here with Kayla's hair because I use a dull scissor. I, then I used my material scissor. I don't like to do with it, but they are. I wasn't in the mood to or less to go and look for another scissor. But now everyone's hair is done now. Once this job is a little bit. So I'm just going to leave them like this so they hair can dry completely. I don't know if it's going to take just overnight or a few days. Um, but I'm not going to touch them until the hair is completely dry. Okay, I'm so happy of the way how all of them hair came out. It's so soft and beautiful. This um, Barbie is, oh, she is so beautiful. Her face, everything, and her hair. Yeah. So, um, even this one, she's beautiful. With her hair. It's still like her hair is a bit of a, a oiling, oiliness in them, but yeah, it's still so soft. Maybe it's not quite dry yet, I don't know, but beautiful. Even this old Barbie of mine, um, her hair came out so beautiful, it's so soft and beautiful, and so straight, all of them. Um, yeah, this one, even with the ponytail, like you saw, I washed it as well. Um, but luckily, everything here is still perfect, and her hair is also just perfect. This one lost a lot of hair when I was washing it, but she's okay still. Um, I've managed to brush it so that it can close all the most of the gaps. But yeah, she lost quite a bit of hair, but still soft and beautiful. And then even Sally's hair is beautiful. It's just wow, I like it. Just came out beautiful, yeah. Um, and then, yeah, I must admit, I am Sharpie again proved themselves because I was worried that the um, you know how many stuff I tried to color here, and at the end of the day, I used the Sharpie, and it did come a little bit of brown when I washed the hair, but look, it's it's perfect, and the hair was most blonde, so um, yeah, I had to cut off. Um, lots of hair here because if you can remember previously I tried so many stuff on a hair to color it I even boiled it and dye and that damaged the hair so but I am happy with the length of hair I just going to do the hot water thing again and um, put something around it because so it doesn't stand like that and just be a little flat so I'm going to do that with her 
and then also Mary like I said I didn't know her hair was so long and um, yeah it's beautiful it's so soft and beautiful but I'm not very impressed with the length of it. It's too long for me. I don't like the um, hair, but hair over the bum thing. So I think I'm going to cut her hair a bit shorter. There is a gap there somewhere that's a bit shorter here. So yeah, I'm going to cut her hair a bit shorter. Okay, and there you go. I like that much better. Just, and now you can see so much looks healthier with all those points that is off. So yeah, I'm happy with all of them. I'm just going to do um, Kaylee's hair quickly. Okay, so like you saw, um, I didn't have the patience to write overnight again. So I should not just blow dry her hair, uh, hair and um, yeah, well, that's the best I could get. And I still think it looks much better than it did before. So um, yeah, um, I'm happy with all these dolls, but I've still got a few other dolls to do as well. Now that I've started with this and I saw that how beautiful the hair came in, I want to do these dolls here as well. Um, I've got this three dolls here. I also did was I bought it from at Facebook Market. Um so they definitely Barbie dolls and um so yeah I'm gonna do their hair and um I have no idea what doll this is. I I don't really like her but her hair looks the balance of them all so that's actually a challenge for me so I'm really going to try with her hair and then do something with her and then this one is exactly the same doll as this one here so um her hair i'm going to make loose when i do her hair i'm gonna see how it looks when it's because i've got most one of that hair now so this one i will do um that other thing but this is for another time um there's so much going on next year so um i will incorporate this with all that's happening next year okay so all my dolls are beautiful now so i'm gonna dress them up a bit and take some photos so in the meantime i hope you enjoyed this video and um yeah you can give it a thumbs up hit that subscribe button so until next time